The 716 in two minutes. Brought to you by Custom Carpet Centers. Good evening, I'm Hannah Bueller from 7 Eyewitness News. We're taking you through the 716 in two minutes. Buffalo police are searching for the people who shot and killed a man on his 21st birthday. This happened Thursday night inside a speedway on Bailey Avenue. Police say store surveillance video shows two men wearing masks as they walked into the store. They say the victim and the shooters knew each other. Governor Cuomo now says it would be reckless to let fans back into Bill Stadium. The stands inside Bill Stadium have been empty all season. Rising COVID-19 rates in western New York means it is not safe to let fans back inside. The weather is going to be better for golfing than skiing, but this is a big day for ski resorts. They're now allowed to open for the season. They have to operate at half capacity. Skiers must also wear a mask and only people from the same group can share a ski lift. Holiday Valley still plans to open three weeks from today. Now let's check in with Michelle McLeod for that 7 First Alert forecast. Well, you're starting off this morning feeling nice and will continue to be nice in the afternoon. Those temperatures will be in the mid to upper 60s. Definitely not feeling like November. In fact, it's no November right now. Now we keep going through the seven day and we'll continue to see those temperatures well above average. We're supposed to be in the 50s this time of year. You're seeing on Sunday, we're in the 60s. I cannot rule out a few 70s. Monday, look at that, 70s again. And in fact, let's talk about some records. Our last time that we hit 70 this time of year on Sunday was in 2011, and on Monday it was in 1891. 70 again on Tuesday and on Wednesday, 65 plus. With eight days of that, the last time, 1938. This is certainly going to be a record setting seven day. The 716 in two minutes brought to you by Custom Carpet Centers.